enjoy your, your side performance and just how significant the victory was that? Yeah, it's a big performance uh, collectively and individually. I thought uh, that we were really good um, against a really good team, that it was in great form, and uh, that it was going to ask us a lot of questions. And I think we responded really well uh, from the start of the game. I think we, we were really determined, really flowing, um, playing with a lot of courage and, and making things happen. And um, yeah, really happy with, it, with the results. It's a big day for our supporters as well. So uh, really happy with that. Arch from the Athletic. Hi, Mikael. Hi. Uh, this is the first time you've used Declan, Martin, Thomas in midfield since the Community Shield. I was just wondering how long have you been waiting to see that again and were you pleased with how they all play together? Yeah, we have the squad available apart from Julian, that hopefully is going to be very soon back with all of us. And we have to utilize the, the players, the quality that we have. And uh, we thought that it was a um, a really good game for Thomas uh, to come back. He looks like he's in rhythm. He trained really well the last few days and the, the way they set up and the players that they have in and the way they attack, especially we believe that it was the right call to make. And then he stepped up. I think he had a great performance and it was really important for the team. Those three, oh, sorry. Oh, go on. Those three all seem to complement each other really well. Um, what is it about that trio that you Everything, but as well when they play Declan, Kai, and Martin, or when we play with Emil as well uh, in there, or with Georgie for sure, because he plays some big games and we won some big, big games with him as well. Depends on the game, on the state, uh, the opponent as well, and it's great because everybody feels important as well, and I think that's uh, something really, really important now. Andy, from the Sun? Hi, Miguel. Hi. Um, it's a hell of a night, a hell of a time in the season to dish out a 5 0 thrashing against a team like Chelsea. Is it, it will send shockwaves through the title race. Just how much of a, a psychological boost is this for your players and for you for what you want at this time of the season? Yeah, great for us, obviously. Um, for the confidence, for the belief that, that we can do it, that we can come to these stages against big teams and we can perform and win games the way we've done it tonight. Uh, so enjoy it and then let's back to work tomorrow because we have a big one on Sunday and we're going to have to prepare really well to, to try to beat them. Sam from the Telegraph. Mikhail, you know Mauricio so well. Is there any part of you feeling any sympathy for him as that, as that went on? All the sympathy in the world uh, with everything that uh, he's been through, with everything that he's doing. He knows that. Uh, and I've been in the other side as well. And uh, nothing. He's doing a great job. I think when you look at this team and analyze six, seven games of them, they, they deserve to win every match. They play big games, big teams, and they deserve to beat all of them. Uh, so. Hopefully, things will turn around and, and be as he deserves. Does that affect your the pleasure you can take from that? No, I love winning and he would try to do the same. But uh, when you talk about sympathy and someone that uh, I love, I admire, uh, for sure I want the best for him. Kyle from Football London. Okay, uh, just again on that midfield, I know you've not really had much of a chance to build them at all, but it was kind of still up you haven't been able to because it was so effective tonight. I don't know, but then we would have won every game because <laughs> look the run that we are in, the amount of points that we have already. And we have missed Thomas, that's true, since August. Um, and he's a big player for us. But as well, that has given the chance to other players, to Declan to play as a six, to rediscover Declan as an eight, uh, playing Kai as a, as, a, as a nine as well. The contribution of Georgie, that has been absolutely phenomenal as well. And, and the team has resources and it has to find different ways of winning and acting and interchanging their qualities and I'm really happy. We've spoken a lot about the team in recent weeks, maybe looking a bit tired in the second half, but today they look so energetic towards the end as well. Is that sort of proof that winning is maybe the best thing when it comes to the team? That's for sure, for the energy and um, and for the for the spirit of the team and uh, the second half we keep growing physically. What these boys have done in the last 10 days is, is unbelievable and you look at the numbers of some of them. It's unreal, but they can do it and they can improve themselves because they want to and they have this mentality that uh, they really want to want to win it. Okay, yeah, no problem. And Mikel, just on that, I mean, it, after the Champions League last week, there was a danger. It kind of a, everyone could have been deflated. Well, it instead seems the complete opposite just six days on. Did you do anything or was the squad just ready to go? Just face the reality. That's it, you know. Uh, the margins are so small and, and sometimes on the day you cannot be better than your opponent or you don't have the luck that you need in certain moments, but what do you have to do? You have to react and, 
and face uh, the moment, and the moment is beautiful. We've been working for it for nine months, so we certainly have to face it in the right way, value what we have, and especially believe. If you are able to do it for nine months, you are able to win it, but you have to believe it first, and you have to consistently do what you've been doing, nothing else. Okay, last couple now. Michael, it must be particularly sweet for a former player to score against the double club. I mean, Kai, Kai has been great for you this season. His, his performance again tonight was, was terrific. Yeah, he was unbelievable. In all departments, uh, and obviously when you put for a nine to score two goals the way he scored, um, his contribution, it was great. And uh, yeah, a question for him, but I'm sure he's very, very pleased. And, and the crowd was, was absolutely joking. You must be enjoying that, and it is that kind of belief and joy immediately translating into, into the players that with the belief that they can do it. That's what we're here for. I think uh, they have to feel that uh, that this team um, is capable of representing them, the club.